Hello, Crawford Avenue family. Today, I want to share with you two quick updates that concern our time together on Sunday mornings. The first is uh, news about our nursery reopening, and the second is an update to our accommodations regarding our mask policy on Sundays. First of all, I'm excited to let you know that our nursery will be reopening on Sunday, December the 6th. As you know, we are blessed as a church uh, with many families with young children. We've been encouraged to see uh, a number of these families attending worship the last few months, even without nursery and kids ministry. Uh, still, we know that reopening nursery will be uh, a help and an encouragement to our families with the youngest children. And so we are looking forward to reopening the nursery on Sunday, December the 6th. We'll have more information about this in the next few weeks, but I do want to assure you that we are committed to providing childcare on Sundays in the safest and healthiest environment possible. So this is going to mean more cleaning than we've done in the past. It's going to mean that we will strictly enforce our wellness policy in the nursery. And it's going to mean that we will uh, ask you to sign up your children in advance if they will be in the nursery on Sunday so that we can make sure that we have enough volunteers and enough space to serve your children well. One thing we know is that we are going to need quite a few volunteers to make this possible. Now, just as before COVID, uh, we do expect that families who use the nursery also are part of the volunteer rotation. And we also want to appeal to the church as a whole, if you would consider signing up right now to volunteer in the nursery. There's a, a sign up link in the comments along with this video. You can click on that and sign up right now and we'll get you all the information you need and get you scheduled to serve. And uh, again, you can watch for more information about this in the next few weeks, but we are excited to be reopening the nursery on December the 6th. And second, I want to share with you an update regarding our mask policy on Sunday mornings. Now, starting this Sunday, November the 8th, we are going to designate the balcony specifically as an area where masks are required. And for those seated on the ground floor, nothing is going to change. We'll continue to encourage you to follow the, the guidance of public health officials and to wear a mask uh, whenever possible. But the, the balcony specifically is going to be set aside as a place where masks are required. We have continued to see our attendance increase each Sunday in recent weeks, and that's been such an encouragement. Uh, we also know that we're entering cold and flu season on top of everything that's going on with COVID. And we want to uh, do everything that we can to allow those in our church family who are most susceptible to illness to be able to join us for worship on Sundays in the safest way possible. And we hope that having a space for masks are required will enable uh, these members of our family to join us on Sundays. So starting this Sunday, November the 8th, masks will be required in the balcony. Now we'll be working through these items and other things in the coming weeks, and you can pray that the Lord will give us grace in these things. Uh, Lord willing, after the first of the year, we'll plan to reopen the rest of our Sunday morning kids' ministries. We're also looking forward to a renewed focus on community groups in January, and then we're hoping to relaunch our Sunday morning Bible study cohorts in February. So you can, again, pray that the Lord will give us grace in all these things, and we'll bless our church as we continue through this time together. Well, that's the announcement for today. I look forward to worshiping with you this Sunday.